Social media can either be the best or the worst place. On the upside, it's a free encyclopedia we can get quick answers from, it helps us stay connected to friends, and gives us pick-me-up quotes when we're struggling. On the downside, we might experience fear of missing out, or what is commonly known as FOMO. We scroll through Instagram, Facebook, and even YouTube, look at other people's lives captured and sometimes think, man, why am I so boring? The truth is, you're probably not. Social media is often a depiction of people's best moments. And let me tell you, being interesting means having substance, not perfection. So, want to learn how to captivate people and live the life you want? Here are 10 ways to be more interesting. One, stop being lazy. Oh man, laziness basically breeds boring. If you expect others to always do the talking or entertain you, then you're sadly mistaken. Think about it. What does the world actually owe you? Why should they suddenly find you creative, talented, or inspiring when you aren't putting in the work to make that happen? Instead of living your life passively, figure out what interests you and take up new hobbies. You don't have to be great at something, just curious and open-minded. Two, do what scares you. If you only do what's predictable and familiar, it should be no surprise that you'll get that in return too. You don't have to necessarily do crazy big things like skydiving or constant traveling. We get it. Realistically, our finances won't always match with our ideals. But start making a list of what you believe you'll regret not trying when you die. Often, the change we're looking for lies outside our comfort zone. Whether it's fear of failure, disappointment, or change that holds you back, figure out what the root cause is and work through it with positive self-talk. 3. Care about what's happening in the world. I don't blame you if you avoid watching the news. It can be downright depressing, and who wants more negativity, right? But there's a difference between being unaware and being indifferent. It's gonna sound so cliche, but Gandhi was right. Be the change you wanna see in the world. If you're bored with your life or what's happening in your town, school, or workplace, take the initiative by creating proposals or getting involved. Four. Be a good listener. No one likes a chatterbox, so sharpen your listening skills and pay attention to people when they talk. You don't have to agree with everything they say, but people appreciate it when you understand where they're coming from. Follow up with some open-ended questions instead of just nodding. This creates a healthy balance in the conversation, in which the other individual will receive a good impression of you. 5. Carry a notebook wherever you go. You don't need to be the next New York Times bestseller or have your works be featured in a modern art museum to be deemed artsy or innovative. But recording observations can stimulate interesting thoughts. Take a few minutes each day to jot down what you see, how you feel, and what you've accomplished. Whether you do this on the train ride home or during your lunch break at work, your notebook will collect all this and you can turn to it again when you need to revisit certain ideas. 6. Come forth about your discoveries. Let your guard down and share what you've learned. No one likes a success story unless it's jam-packed with failures, roadblocks, and a bad decision every now and then. Those moments that you may beat yourself down over are actually the essential ingredients that make you dynamic and give you depth. Talk about the times you've been rejected and made mistakes. Not only does it make you human, but it helps others relate to you as well. 7. Consume new things. If you're the type of person to only follow trends, read, eat, and do what everyone else is doing, well, are you actually being more interesting, or are you just being a follower? Broaden your horizon and explore things outside of your location. You might discover music before it's a huge hit, unique clothing items, and delicious recipes people will be dying to ask you for. 8. Avoid forming cliques. We all want to belong somewhere, right? But picking just one group to fit in will limit you from meeting people who can provide refreshing different perspectives. Don't be consumed by your social status and talk to people from all walks of life. Converse with elderly folk, children, teenagers, and people with different backgrounds, religions, races, genders, and hobbies. Diversity is an amazing experience to embrace that enriches your knowledge in life for the better. 9. Work hard towards your goals. It's okay to be discouraged every once in a while, or even a lot. That's normal and to be expected. But when you stay unmotivated and apathetic towards self-improvement, your lifestyle will only stay the same. 
Being interesting doesn't necessarily translate to eating the healthiest foods or exercising until you get a six pack, but when you become passionate and responsible about making certain things happen, it makes you stand out. Pace yourself, break your big goals into smaller ones, and create a reasonable timeline. You can do it. 10. Don't obsess and always try so hard. In anything we do in life, it's important to work hard, but don't do it to the point of burnout. That only makes you counterproductive. Sometimes, less is more. You don't have to make big life changes in order to be interesting. Allow progress to happen naturally, and remember, above everything, stay true to yourself. Want to see more quality animated content? Check out and subscribe to Datus's channel. Step into his shoes as he walks through his life. Funny, authentic, and down to earth, you'll find yourself relating and laughing. If you also like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. As always, thanks for watching.